All right, so I'm going to go through a series of videos uh, to walk through how to get this practice management app up and working. So let me just talk a little bit about what the functionality is. Um, obviously, this is for Georgia College, uh, our advanced web development class. And what we're going to do in this tutorial is have a, a home page here. And when you log in, up at the login button it's going to change the navigation okay so we'll just go admin and pepsi and sign in so once it logs in you can tell it's logged in because it has uh, the schedule up here and you can schedule teams and schedule practices okay so if i come down and i click on teams it will list the teams so i can add a team so let's just say um, uh, Georgia Bulldogs all right click submit it adds a team okay you can update it so when it updates it brings the mascot over okay I can say Georgia Bulldogs and spell it actually how it's supposed to I don't think that's how it's spelled but I think that's how they say it and then we can go up and go click on the practice time and schedule a practice time so if I add an add a practice item I can say the length of it's going to be 30 minutes and it will be scheduled for this weekend and it's for Georgia click submit and you'll notice that it comes down and it brings the date in and you can update that practice time um, it doesn't look like I have the drop down for Georgia so we'll add that we'll have it we'll, we'll need to still add that drop down for Georgia okay but uh, it will update it so let's just change it to the 27th click submit and you'll notice that the date changed to the 27th and then you should also be able to delete practice times so we can click delete and that practice time is gone and if I come over here and delete Atlanta delete the whole team and come back to look at practice that the practices for that team have also been deleted even out of the database so uh, this is the app on the app this is what we want to be able to do so I'm gonna log out um, it, we should be able to do a couple things. We want to look at all the teams through a drop down. Uh, add, we want to be able to uh, show the current team practice. We want to use modals, and we want all the practices to be deleted if the team is deleted. So those are our three big things. We'll be using Flask for this, and this is basically just a, a project overview. We will also be using Heroku uh, as our um, as our application. To push everything to and we will also be looking at it locally so we'll be running it locally using uh, the pie charm